the race has been run and won by Copy That, and his driver Blair Orange joins me now. Firstly, Blair, congratulations. Yeah, cheers, mate. Big thrill. Big thrill. Um, big win meant a lot to a lot of people here. I just saw Debbie. She's uh, she's in trouble, and of course that would be Zach, the, the peanut. He ran second, and that's how excited he is too. Don't worry about that. But well done, mate. Nah, cheers. Yeah, no, everything just worked out perfect. I hate running second, but. Good on you. <laughs> <laughs> Some of my best work there, and it's only a cameo from him, so it's even better. Um, man, it does mean a lot to the whole stable there, doesn't it? Oh, of course it does. You know, the horse has had his ups and downs health-wise, and, you know, he's travelled here and afar, and, you know, they've, every time he's produced on the racetrack, he's, apart from, unfortunately, the Honda Cup, you know, he's always shown how good he is, and just really pleased for the horse and also the team that put that, all that work into him. I find it... Uh, I suppose a little bit odd and frustrating uh, some of the criticisms, especially around the Hunter Cup I mean, the horse had his own issues the stables had a fair issue as well I mean, the trainer was down and out Like, I mean, people forget that part and they seem to say that you know, he can be a bit susceptible. I think he's a lovely horse. He's a perf not necessarily a perfect race horse. I don't know what is these days but um, when he get, can get to the front like that, he, no one's going to beat him no, well, you can never say no one's going to beat him, but he's uh, he's just such a lovely horse when he's in the zone, and you know he doesn't have to lead all the time. He's actually very fast off a helmet, but when you draw like we did tonight in those type of races, you take full advantage of it, and yeah, it's um, just a credit to the horse. Credit to the horse and everyone around him. The way you handle him, um, you took all that in your stride. Well, you know, it's, it was, I just thought the way it panned out on paper, like he was going to get his chance from the draw, and you know, if he got beat, he got beat. So, uh, yeah, I was pretty happy with the way the draws fell in our favour, and obviously the result. What about the crowd? I, um, I was standing down there in the Whitton Post, and the noise from that crowd when you guys were turning for home, it must have been, was it, what was it like being out there? Uh, to be honest, I couldn't actually hear them. Um, but just just seeing the, the amount of people that were here today just just shows that there's still the love for racing and in New Zealand and you know it's a full credit to the club for what they've done and just great to see people here again. Absolutely, I like seeing that emotion like what Debbie showed just then and everyone here, Andrew's there, they're all watching him and looking after him. But it's a team effort. Ray's up there. Um probably doing the speeches, he doesn't like doing the speeches and that, and then of course they've all got to put up with Zach unfortunately, so they, you know, they get everything here, that's for sure, but it is a big team effort, I was fortunate enough to be there yesterday, and um, they all take pride in their work, they've had a good night, they've had three winners for the stable tonight as well, so it's been a very, very good effort by the whole team, so um, well done mate, and uh, congratulations. Cheers, thanks very much. Thanks, Blake.